Fine 2K community. Let me talk to you. Yeah. What's up, 2K fam? I got some exciting news for you today. It's mid-season, new build. Let's get it. So before we get into it, do me a huge favor and drop that like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell, cause the grind game, we here, baby. Send the rocket game. Baby, while on my 2K journey, I decided to head to Dester's laboratory and create the ultimate catfish center build of the year. I'm talking about a two way mid range slasher, aka you might just catch a fade from this build, and it can do everything. It got speed, elite post moves, hall of fame fade, dead eye shooting ability, and most importantly, red iron defense. Oh, let's not forget the most juiciest handles in the game and it's all in the palm of your hands so let's head to the my player builder and get this party started so we making this build at the center position for the height we going six eight yeah that's right we small but we're gonna be like thanos in the paint just trust just believe in the process for the weight we're going 248 we want this build to be heavy and a beast in the paint also this will allow us to get hall of fame enforcer and i don't know about you guys this stops any ball handle in their tracks making it impossible to blow past you for the slam for the wingspan we're going seven five and the reason for that is because i want to have at least an 86 mid range and i will explain shortly all right hit continue now for your physicals let's go ahead and get that out the way speed 75 acceleration 70 strength 95 remember what i told you we trying to get this badge right here hall of fame enforcer having this will make us over power and a hook in the paint and plus you get gold brick wall vertical take that up to an 80 and for your stamina turn it all the way up now for your finishing one of the best highlights of this build is post scoring capabilities so we taking that straight to a 90 no if ends or buts about it standing dunk 40 driving dunk 60 layups 61 now when you look at these stats your first impression might be Man, I don't know. But trust me, you can still finish with this build. That 60 driving dunk gives you basic two-handed dunk packages. And they almost never get blocked in the game. And for layups, Pro Touch is crazy on any badge level. Do I need to say more? Most importantly, the number one badge we're looking to get is Hall of Fame mind-blowing post-fade phenom, which will turn Hall of Fame here shortly. For shooting, mid-range, that's going to an 86 having it this high for the most part will allow you to have more access to jump shot bases now that we have an 86 mid range this gives us hall of fame post fade phenom and most importantly we get open looks on gold these badges will make life easier whenever you want to fade in the post or be consistent from the three for your three pointer we're gonna take that to a 76 and the reason why for that is to make sure you get at at least agent three on bronze and corner specialist on silver you never know when you might have to get a shot off quick agent three definitely helps out with that i definitely recommend these shooting stats for anybody creating a center build this will keep you from being a liability on offense and plus everybody likes a center that can shoot for playmaking pass accuracy take that to a 75 this gives us very minimal badges at least ball handling 81 i have an 81 because if you go to an 80 you get a whole different name and i don't know about you guys but i love the name two-way mid-range slasher also with a ball handling this high you get hall of fame physical handles making it easier to size up anybody and get past them for the slam layup or whatever you trying to do speed with ball 75 this is going to give you bronze badges having dribbling capabilities make this 
is still a overwhelming threat to any defender any given time on the court i'm not a fancy dribbler but we all know it only takes a few moves to get open shots defense interior 88 this gives us gold everything perimeter 75 this is most important than steals in my opinion i'm not an ex spammer and i value clamps highly and this gives us bronze but don't worry because with hall of fame enforcer this makes your center op you are a center remember that this is not a category people usually focus on for centers all right for your block 92 offensive rebound 70 defensive rebound 92 now you get goal anchor and goal rebound chaser let me tell you let me tell you something about this build it can rebound height makes no difference in my world my couple games into playing wreck i went against a 7-3 center and i grabbed at least about 15 to 20 boards that 95 strength crazy strong in the paint a demigod you might say <laughs> now i asked the 2k guards what do you think and they told me well done my boy so i think we pretty good so now you have created a two-way mid-range slasher masterpiece and what can i say the name itself gives me chills up my spine i drive vc faster than i paid my bills <laughs> so before i let you go let me show you the basic dump packages and dribble packages i use that makes this build so nasty when it comes to dunking i only use two-handed dunks i absolutely love the animations whether they are contact dunks or not so there's only three i use which is rim grazer off two next will be hang you should equip hangs off two and last but not least basic you're going to want to equip basic two handers off two and i don't know about y'all but these animations for this package is basically quick drop offs and we all know what quick drop off does for our bills in 2k also for standard dunks for regular make sure you choose two-handed under basket regular all right for the dribble packages here you can see exactly what i use so go ahead and take a screenshot and save it to your phone now you do not get behind the back jamal murray but lamello ball is just as nasty just look at it mm, it creates so much room and that zach levine step back oh my god let me just say but fire juicy it can't get no better than that man send a rocket game boom baby all right i'd like to thank y'all for watching you did me a huge favor by doing so now i need y'all to go ahead and drop that like and subscribe if you already haven't done it and hit that notification bell because i wouldn't come this far without you guys so let's all strive to be great holla at your boy